Fox and ESPN have agreed to open negotiations early with the Big 12, even though those talks were not set to begin until the beginning of 2024. Now, I do find this interesting because one of the reasons why, and that's not who I'm looking for, I'm looking for this. Uh, One of the reasons why the uh, Oklahoma and Texas move happened is because they were not happy with the fact that ESPN would not reopen negotiations with the Big 12, what, last summer, sometime around there? they The Big 12 wanted to make sure that they got plenty of money, et cetera, et cetera, and yet here we are a year later, and ESPN and Fox both have said, yeah, we'll go ahead and start this because they understand that the landscape is shifting and the Big 12 wants to get out ahead of the Pac-12. Pac-12 opened their negotiations a little bit early, slightly earlier than the Big 12. But now, everybody's going to be able to figure out exactly what the media rights are worth across the board. So the schools like Arizona, Arizona State, Colorado, and Utah can figure out, hey, would it benefit us more to go over to the Big 12 or to stay in the Pac-12? You can figure those things out. And it's kind of the same thing with Washington and Oregon, etc., right? Which we're going to talk more about Washington here in just a minute. But I do find this surprising because it is so early. It's a year and a half early for the negotiations. And what this does is, you know, it moves it up, but it it allows the Big 12 to get an idea before the Pac-12 ever can get their contract done. So we will figure out the prices for these teams and People are going to be able to make decisions. And that way, maybe a good part of this is that it gets done earlier so we don't have to continue talking about this, right? Like, it, it's still going to take a while for everything to happen. And these these rights are not going to go into effect for a little while. Uh, the issue with this is, you know, ESPN was not willing to reopen negotiations while Oklahoma and Texas were still in the Big 12. But now that Oklahoma and Texas have committed to joining the SEC, Well, now ESPN might be wanting to get them uh, over to the SEC quicker because the SEC on CBS contract ends after next season, after the 2023 season. So I do think it is a smart idea for ESPN to go ahead and speed this thing up. That way, maybe they can find a way to get CBS out of their contract, etc. for that last season. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.